All right, we're back. Fallout 4. Oh my lord. Yesterday was the hardest day of my life. <laughs> we have spent two days in, in the Boston Wastelands, also known as the Commonwealth, apparently, and day one was pretty good. Yeah, we met Preston Garvey, we got some some cool guns, and we felt like we had the world at our feet. We could go anywhere, we could do anything, we could be anything we wanted to be. And then day two brought us back down to Earth with a great big thump, because not only is apparently ammo the hardest thing in the world to find, uh, but apparently according to one of my new followers, Abyss Fortune, thank you for following by the way, that I'm a terrible shot. Um, which doesn't really help in a shooty game, yes. Uh, not only that, I've been sent on a quest to clear the Corvega assembly plant of all the raiders, and I accidentally ran into not only a group of ghouls, which are apparently fast and terrifying, but I also went into a cemetery and attack got attacked from behind by a raider. Um, so yeah, pretty much everything went wrong yesterday. <laughs> However, However, not every- well, oh yeah, apart from- I, I, I may have killed uh, Sully Mathis as well after not being able to successfully pickpocket him. But in my defense, I feel he was working with the Mylurk, so whatever. But yes, not everything was disastrous yesterday. We got ourselves our first shop, our first proper stable bartering place, which is Trudy's. Uh, bar, what's it called? The Devlin Diner, I think? So we got that, that makes me feel a little bit safer, because she's always got ammo on it, which is great. I mean, there was someone else as well, uh, Trash Can Carla, or whatever she was called. But she seems like more of a wanderer. So, we're going to rely on Trudy for our shop. Now, in between last episode and this episode, or last stream and this stream if you're watching live on Twitch, I um, went back to Trudy's, I got a bit more ammo, and I had a little bit of an explore, because to be honest, I've been struggling to find these extra raiders. Apparently there's a butt ton, and this is like the worst quest to do early on. So, yeah, of course Upstart DJ's gonna do it. <laughs> oh, god damn it. Alright, let's continue. Dog meat's here. Uh, I have five bullets. Five bullets in my gun. So that is enough for you, dog meat. Enough for me. Um, and we may be able to take a couple of guys out as well. Uh, we are full health, which is nice. A rare treat, I must say. Uh, the, uh... Oh, shh. Guys. Guys. I heard them. Where are they? Where are they? I heard them. Where are you guys? God damn it. If only I could see through walls. Um... I definitely heard someone. I want to I want to be following this marker I think but I don't think I can. I think this is a bit of a dead end. Like it leads to this place but not much else. I mean thankfully I did find some guys with stim packs because we're running really low on stim packs unfortunately. Oh, nuke cold ball. Nice. Take a bit of that. We like our, our our caps. Yeah, like is it over here that I need to go? Uh I imagine Hmm, I guess Corvega is some kind of car, uh, factory place thing. Oh! My arm. Wow. Well, I don't know what happened there. <laughs> God damn it! This world is dangerous, ladies and gentlemen. Um, again, yeah, I apologize if I'm a bit of a scrub, but, uh, it's been a while since I played a Fallout game, like, previous to Fallout 4 anyway. Uh, I think I completed New Vegas around Christmas time. So, uh, yeah. Not very stealthy, we're gonna put the light on, because I'm blind as a bat. Uh, is there anything in here? Camera that's probably rigged to explode. Dog meat in my way, which is probably rigged to explode. Uh, more sinks, don't need those, we're full health now. Uh, that's the exit. I don't want to go through the exit. I imagine I don't want to go through the exit anyway. Oh well, dead in the corner. Dead in the corner. Got anything good down here, mate? No? Okay. Um, right, let us continue. Oh, I was also told of a little cheat yesterday uh, by, again, my good friend, my new follower, Abyss, um, Abyss Fortune, I think it was his name. Um, yeah, I think it was. Uh, he told me that I could get the cryolator very, very early by uh, using this guy. Apparently this guy could get me the cryolator very, very early from Vault 111. I did look up a video of this just to see if he was right, and he was right, but I am not going to do it. I'm not going to do it because it seems a little cheaty. I, I think that you're supposed to unlock the cryolator using Master Lockpick. 
How a dog is able to get the gun himself, uh, I have no idea. So we're going to leave it. We're going to leave the cryolator until we get Master Lockpick. When we're going to get it the nice normal way, and hopefully um, it'll be amazing. I mean, hopefully we'll be able to get it sooner rather than later, because, uh, you know, apparently it's OP as hell. All right, what do we have down here? Again, we're not very stealthy with our light on, but um, what can you do? Like, is this the way we're supposed to be going? Yeah. Okay. Uh, anybody in here? Oh, that's a turret. Hey, buddy. All right, we see a turret. Uh, come on, Roy. We're gonna do it. We're gonna do it. Go for the body shots. Oh, yeah. And I also learned what criticals are as well now, by the way. Uh, in, whilst you're in VATS, you can do some kind of critical shenanigans, which uh, increases damage from uh, time to time. Uh, so I've learned that as well. I've done a lot of learning. Uh, probably forgotten it all, but uh, I've done quite a bit of learning, and uh, I feel like I'm a little better equipped today. Um, <laughs> I use that term lightly, considering that I'm still using uh, weapons that are basically made out of pipes, but still, uh, we're slightly better equipped. Uh, oh, two stim packs. Don't mind if I do. Uh, the reason why I'm being quite light on looting, by the way, is... Uh, uh, oh, God. Yeah, there's one. There's... Can I long-range shotgun? Oh, God. Oh, I can. Oh, wow. What a fantastic shot. And again. No, nope, missed it. All right. Come here, you buggers. Oh, hello. Hello. Worst decision you ever made. Bang! There you go. Back into it. Back into it. See, look how much control we have over the game now. Probably not much, but still, we're doing a little better. Um, is that guy still there? Oh, uh, no, she's on the move. Or he's on the move. Someone's on the move. Oh, there you are. There you are. Give me that bat. Uh, we'll go 54. We'll go 66. Oh, don't miss. Don't miss. I need this to hit. Thank you. Okay. Now, if there's no more raiders... And if it's just the turret, then we can slowly take that down using the uh, the really bad short laser musket. This is a really bad gun, ladies and gentlemen. I don't know if this they gave you this, and uh, you know it was like a kind of like a cool gun to give or something. I absolutely hate it. I, I think it's like the worst thing in the world. Uh, but then again, it is supposed to be pretty bad. It's like a musket, you know, back in. Back in the day, muskets weren't too hot. They were, you had to like, fire a little bullet and then pour the gunpowder in for the next shot, stick your little brush down there and all that. And this kind of feels the same, apart from you have to crank a handle every time you want to shoot a, a, a laser shot, you know? It's, it, it's, 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 a, it's fun. It's a fun little kind of historical gag. It's called a musket for a reason, so um, yeah, it's, 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 it's an okay weapon for taking out these guys at range, but that's about it. Um, right. We're also going to take a look at crafting today as well. We're going to go back to Sanctuary and we're actually going to take a proper look at crafting. Um, I wish you'd tell me what I can kind of like break... What the hell is that? Oh, girls! Hello! Where did you come from? Where did you come from? Dog me, please! Dog me! That's it! That's it, boy! Good boy! Oh! Oh, dog me! Take this cue ball. No, don't. Thank you so much, dog meat. Jesus Christ. <laughs> that was terrifying. Okay, uh, where were we? Uh, yes, we are going to take a look at crafting today because uh, I didn't really understand it first off, but um, I feel like I understand it a little bit more now. So we're going to take a look at that and hopefully do some stuff in Sanctuary, um, make some beds. I know that's one of the things that we need to do. We need to make some beds. Apparently, I can scrap houses and cars. Apparently I've been told that, which is a nice little tip, because I had no idea that I could scrap like massive things like old houses and old cars. And that apparently that's a good way of getting steel. So we're going to be doing a little bit of that as well. So yeah, fun to be had. Again, no idea if anyone's here to hear that, but uh, fun to be had. Uh, is that a turret? That sounds like a turret. That? Yep, that's a turret. Okay. Um... Oh, I don't really want to take it head on in a hallway where there's nowhere to hide. So we're going to go this way instead. Now, of course, I know what you're all saying. The uh, the shotgun, not the greatest stealth weapon in the world, Upstar DJ. And you know what? You're not wrong. You are not wrong, friends. However, 
It's the best I get. <laughs> Till I get like a regular supply of pistol ammo and uh, a silencer. That would be nice. I heard the silencers in this game, so uh, yeah, if we want to go the whole stealth route, then uh, silencers might be a good thing. Uh, turn the light on. Turn the light on. Bit of jet. Don't mind that. Mama Murphy will like that. Oh, oh, don't want any of that. Stay away from rats. Rats aren't great, ladies and gentlemen. I mean, we have already died in this playthrough. Again, anyone new watching, we've already died. So if you're expecting some kind of hardcore Fallout 4 master, you ain't getting none. None of that. Not here. Uh, paintbrush. Nope. Uh, coolant caps. No. Turpentine. No. It's hard to really know what's good when you've just started. Uh, MH. I am playing on normal. I know, not very exciting, but it's like literally my first playthrough, and I've not played Fallout for a while, so I'm having to relearn everything, so yes. This is currently on normal, and if it helps you enjoy the game any better, it's still kicking my ass, so it's kind of like hard mode for me. Uh, welcome to the stream, by the way. Um, hope you're having a fantastic day. Um, I may talk a lot to myself, but I also talk a lot to my viewers, so uh, thank you for dropping by, and I hope you have some fun. If not, then don't worry about it. Because my stream's not that fun, to be honest. But still, <laughs> if you find something to enjoy, then uh, good for you, man. Good for you. Uh, I am pretty much lost. I feel like I'm just scouring this lower area. I know that I need to go to the roof. There's a lot of guys on the roof that I need, need to kill, so we, we are heading there. I just wanted to kind of explore the rest of it as well. Yeah, I wish I could get in there and get to those, those ammo cases, but Master Luck is a little beyond us, unfortunately. All right, let's head upstairs. Um, oh, Mr. Ray Coma is here as well. Uh, good day to you, my good friend. How are you today? How is everybody? If, if anyone can hear my voice right now, how is everybody? How are your lives going? Are we all well? Make sure that you are all well, because I want nothing but happiness in this stream. Yesterday, I was incredibly negative. Everything went wrong. I got ganked by my alerts. I got... I, I murdered Sully Mathis. You know, it all went wrong. Mr. Raycoma woke up. You know what? That is a good thing, my good friend. <laughs> yeah, don't sleep through my streams, man. I need the viewers. Now, they're saying that. Apparently, I've got four viewers now. That's pretty good. I mean, one of them is me, but still, you know, four viewers. Not too bad. Not too bad. Well, I'm glad you're here anyway, my friend. Always appreciate your company, Mr. Ray. And, of course, yours, MH679212. Um, very much appreciated. Thank you for dropping by. Oh, dear. I could not actually imagine playing this game on hard mode or even survival mode. I have had such a kind of baptiz baptism of fire. Is that what they say? Oh, that was a waste. Um, oh, Dogme found an enemy. Oh! Uh, where? Where did you find him? Go get him, boy. Go get him. Go get him, boy. No? Just gonna slowly walk. Cool. Yep, take your time, mate. Take your time. Um, Glow-sighted heavy pipe pistol. That sounds fun. If you found. If you found. He's found someone. No? Okay. I don't quite get dog meat from time to time. He, he seems to find something or seems to be interested in something, and then he just loses interest. Like, whether I'm supposed to, like... I don't know, do do the, the, the work and actually find what he's finding or whatnot. Like, maybe he gets me close, then I'm supposed to search it out at the at the end. But, yeah, he seems to kind of half-arse it, which uh, is not good in my eyes, to be honest with you. I want him to be an incredibly useful uh, member of the team. I mean, dog me, if you want this dog ball, you've got to work a little bit harder, boy. All right? Got to kill the bad guys. Don't just die to them. Oh, shotgun shells. Nice! That is what we want. We found so little ammo in this game. Like, I don't know, it's, it reminds me of Fallout 3. In Fallout 3, I found so little ammo. Like, it, it, was, it was frightening. Like, I, I'm so glad that in New Vegas, I went punch only. Because I, I, I just couldn't be bothered looking for ammo in a brand new game. Like, if I'd played guns in, in New Vegas, I, I would have just, like, screamed. Because... <laughs> It was so hard to find ammo. You'd think it would be everywhere, but Lord knows it's not really. Not the good stuff anyway. I'm finding this 38 crap, but uh, 
What I want is 10 millimeter for my reliable pistol. All right, so this was the area that I hadn't checked yet. Now, this is quite a bad area for me for two reasons. One, it's bound to be filled with guys. I think there's one up there. Uh, yeah, there's one up there. And two, shotguns aren't long range, believe it or not, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, so, I need to make sure that I see them and kill them before they see me and kill me. We do have stealth packs. Stealth packs? Okay. Stim packs now. Oh, God. Oh, ah, run! Run! Run, 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 run. Run. Where did he shoot from? Uh, he must have been up here. He must have been. Oh, God. How did you... What? You shoot... Oh, there you are. Okay, I see you. I see you. I see you there. All right, okay. Uh, took a bit of damage. Uh, stim pack. Let's do the stim packs. Boop. <coughs> oh, God. Oh, God. Here we go. We're going to go around. Wait. Oh, God. I'm taking a lot of damage from these guys. Uh, medics? Do I have medics? Please have medics. Yeah, I do have medics. No, uh, all right. We're going to run around. Uh, that was fire. Raider scum. Die! Ooh, took a shotgun. Blast to the face. That makes sense. Please don't make me reload. You're going to make me reload, aren't you? All right, thankfully it's going to reload in, in that. And I'm not going to miss. Happy days are here again. All right, cool. So we nailed her at the very least. Anything useful here? Oh, ha, ha. Awesome. Oh, bobblehead. Bingo. Oh, I got the repair bobblehead. See, today is already a much better day than yesterday. Why go down with the ship when you can just fix it? Fusion cores permanently last 10% longer. That is fantastic. Grenade! Oh, God. Run. Boom. Guess he threw it off the edge. What an idiot. Right. Let's go. Whilst this Maddox is still running. Let's go. Go find these other losers and hopefully... Uh, yeah, there you are. Hey, loser. Give me that VAT. Give me that VAT action. One hit KO. Not quite. Please have another shot. Yeah. Here we are. Take your time. Take your time, Roy. Yeah? Oh. Now, I do realize that I have my critical shot there. However, I'm not going to waste it. Um, I'm only going to use it when I desperately need it. Oh, God. Okay. Things might get a little laggy up here. There is a lot of stuff. Oh, my Lord. Take a look. It's a bit gloomy. PC range would probably uh, show off that quite beautifully, however. Nope. Not quite. We only get to see the gloomy version, but I like the gloom. You know, gloom's not too bad in a game like this. It's a very gloomy world that we live in. It's It's been destroyed by nuclear war and whatnot, so yeah, I, I don't mind a bit of gloom. Um, have I killed everyone then? I assume I'm supposed to get some kind of marker. I mean, I thought there would be lots of guys up here. I've killed two, and... I don't know, I feel like I've traversed the entirety of this roof, and yet, no one else is shooting me. Are we good? I think we might be good. I, yeah, I, I, I think we might be actually pretty good. Unless I'm going to go down there as well, but, uh, you know, unless anyone shoots at me, I'm not going to know that they're here. Like, fact. Uh, I mean, how do I even get down now? Is it down here? Boop. Um, all right, stirs, please reveal yourself to me. There's some over here, right? Yeah, over here, stirs. Yeah, okay, cool, cool. I mean, the 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 actual quest markers keep telling me to go back through that door. Oh, there's oh, there's loads more. There's more over here as well. Okay. Um, all right, we'll check over here as well. See if there's anything here. Oh, there's a door over here as well. Wait, what? Oh, is this? Hmm, okay. It's a different way to get into the building. Maybe this will reveal a whole room of raiders. That would be fun. Yeah? No? Hopefully not. I mean, hopefully so, because that's the quest. But hopefully not, because I will die. <laughs> oh. Are we good? Oh. Ah. 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 Clever. Clever. Alright, cool. Um... So where is this quest marker? I don't quite understand where this quest marker is. Where is it telling me to go? And why do I keep doing that? I have no idea why I keep doing that. Um, Alright, quest marker is telling me to go here. Way beyond. Or is that just in the world map? Hmm. 
Like, that might be in the world map. Like, does that mean I've killed everything then? I, sh I would assume that I've got, like, a quest update if I killed everything. There's obviously something that I'm missing. Yeah, there's, there's obviously something that I'm missing. Uh, I kind of didn't want to go through an entire, like, um, wild goose chase just for one raider that I've not actually found. Because uh, th that would take forever. I I I'm probably looking for one single raider. There's, there's going to be one raider somewhere that I've not found, and I don't think I'll ever find him. Or her. I'm pretty sure raiders can be ladies. Uh, well, ladies can be raiders. Um, yeah, it's telling me to go in here. So this is where I'm supposed to be. Ah, Mr. Ray, we're looking for one raider, man. I bet that's what we're doing. Looking for a single raider. Are you ready for that hot stream action where we'll, we look for one raider for the entirety of the stream? Are you ready for that? You ready for that? I don't think you're ready for that, man. Let's check these bottom floors. Check these bottom floors again. There's gonna, I mean, you'd think that going around this entire place like three times over, you'd think um, one raider would have seen me by now. Like, you'd think so. I mean, obviously not. Obviously they're blind. Or maybe I'm blind. I'm thinking more I'm blind. Yeah, I think it's more me. I mean, we killed the ghouls as well, didn't we? Oh, ah, ah, hello. Hello, what about up here? Oh, God, the stairs! Oh, I'm such an idiot! Uh, any more aluminium? No? Apparently aluminium is very important. Uh, pack of cigarettes. Oh, don't do it! Okay, fine. Fine, I'm over encumbered. Oh, I'm regretting, uh... Regretting uh, you, uh, only having one strength now. Let's drink a... Let's drink a quantum. There you go. Is that enough? That'll do for now. That'll do for now. Alright. Okay, let's go. Uh, we're gonna sneak, actually. I think this might be where the marker is trying to, like, guide me to. Hopefully. M more cigarette... Oh. Wait, is this? Is this new? There's an elevator here. This looks new. It looks a lot flatter than normal. Let's turn our light off, just in case. Yeah, yep. Yeah. Oh god. Yeah, I see the turret. I see the turret. Go get him, boy. Go get him, boy. Dog me. Go get him, boy. Here we go. Long shot. Long shot. Roy Silvers. Sniper. Shotgun. Extraordinaire. Oh god, there's so many. There's so many. Uh, dog me. You're on your own, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> that is so many. Oh, I don't want any of this. Yep. Yep. Dog. Oh my. Oh my god. Molotov cocktails? Are you serious? Uh. Okay. Um. We have some more medics. Yep, we are now addicted to medics. Hooray. It was only a matter of time. Um. Bottle cap mine, maybe? That could be fun. Alright, how do we do it? Is this this one, right? No, it's not. Uh, we're gonna do that. Hey guys! Over here! Come over here! Please! Anyone? I'm over here, guys! I'm over here! Guys, please! Dog, don't set it off! Alright, good. I'm over here, guys! Anyone? Anyone? No! Come on, come over here. Blow up my mine. They're, not, they're obviously not that bothered about me. Maybe we can all be friends. Probably not. Probably not, guys. Probably not. See, look, I'm hidden again. I'm going to forget about that bottle cap mine and probably blow myself up with it. Place your bets now on whether that will actually happen. Oh, God. I mean, I'm enjoying sneaking right now, but I feel like... Uh, I feel like I'm going to be dead very soon. And the turrets are very good at spotting you. I've noticed that. Alright. Oh, ready to scum. There you go. Ready to scum. Let's do it. We're going to critical this as well. Bang. There you go. Got one. Got rid of one already. Got rid of an early one. Uh, the bottle cap mine is now rendered useless, unfortunately. I feel like dropping a save. Oh, it's Jared! Oh, Jared from Subway! We can't talk about him anymore because he's a bad man, but still, we're going to drop a save. We're going to drop a save right now. Yeah. Again, it might not even matter, but we're going to do it. We're going to do it, guys. We're going to do it. Roy Silvers. 
Normally, not afraid, but totally afraid right now. Um, okay, what do you have, by the way? Kind of... Oh. Yeah, I hear you. I hear you. Roy Silvers can hear you. Oh, God. Am, am I supposed to go up from those stairs around here? Man, come back. I was fun. No, Jared, please. Jared, I'm a nice guy. Let's just talk this over. No? Oh, God. Wait. Oh, there's a lady as well. There's a late. There's a late. Oh, 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 God. Um. Is that the, uh. Is that the turret? I assume that's the turret, right? Sounded like the turret. Yeah, I'm in danger. I'm in danger. I'm also getting radiated to buggery right now. Oh, God. Fire. Oh, so much fire. We're out of here. Remember the bottle cap mine? Yeah, we're out of here. Screw you, Jared. Screw you. Um. Okay. I need a plan of action. I need a plan of action. First of all, I need to stim pack like buggery. Uh, stim packs. Boop. I only have two left. That's not good. All right. So they're up there. Unless I feel like sniping. I wonder if we can snipe. Let's see if we can snipe. Um. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, we go. Let's snipe. Now, can we get any kind of vats? We can get the ball cap mine. Jared, we got a 7% chance to hit. You know what? YOLO. YOLO. Maybe if he knows I'm shooting at him, he will want to come out and investigate. He, he pro more than likely wouldn't know. Jared, please. Jared, where are you? Jared, where are you? No, he's... He's up there somewhere. If I just fire off random shots, will they will they find me? How do you even get up there? I assume there's some steps from like the front there. Yeah. Oh, maybe if I throw grenades in. Ah. Maybe if I do that, like throw Molotov cocktails in or something, that might be a good idea. That might be a great idea. Oh yeah, I see. I see. I see you, Jared. Can I get you from here? That would be nice. Can I get you from here? Can I get anyone from here? Oh, God. They can apparently get me from here, so that's cool. Uh, it's an impact. We're afraid now. We're now, we're now afraid. I am not using a stealth boy. This is all natural. Oh, God, seriously. <laughs> oh, our first big challenge. I, have, I honestly have no idea what to do here. Yeah, I don't I don't want to shoot that. Oh wait, the protect Oh, can I use that? Can I use a protector troll? Oh, that might be a plan. That might be a plan. Oh, just run, just run, just run, just run, just run. Right, you don't see me. You don't see me. Stop pretending like you do. Can I use this? No. Is there a panel which will help me use this? Probably not. Oh god. Um Wait, oh, that's the turret, right, okay. Uh, that's, the, that's the turret. Oh, God. Oh, oh, oh. Lord, help me. Lord, help me. Dear, dear Lord. Dear Lord of Fallout. Here we go. Give me someone. Give me someone. 43, I'll take that. I'll take that. Critical shot. No. Did I miss? There you go. Okay, good. Good. Okay. We got rid of one of them. Oh, John! John loves gaming. Oh, welcome, my good friend. I've not seen you for a little bit. How you doing, man? How you doing today? Hopefully you're having a great day. Um. Oh. Oh. Hey, dog meat. You just over there chilling around, chilling like a villain. All right. Joining the enemy. Uh, oh God. Yeah. As you can see, we're having a great time here, John. Um. Having having loads of fun. Uh, 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 run away. <laughs> run away. Yeah, we're having loads of fun with uh, uh, old Jared over here. Yes, uh, Jared likes to throw his explosives. He also has a cheaty turret. And uh, yeah, I I'm struggling here. I lack a lot of ammo. Um, and uh, yeah, I have no idea how to beat this guy. <laughs> Apart from grim determination and occasional critical hits on people that actually wander outside of his little room there. 
Halo 5 Infection is here! Indeed it is. Um, I probably I might do a stream on it tomorrow. Uh, yeah, I wanted to do Fallout for like the final day of the week uh, today, but I might do a stream on it tomorrow. Have you tried it? Is it any good? You tried it? Hopefully you've tried it. Give me the news. I mean, I see you as like a Halo 5 Pro, so what, what's it like? Like, what, what's, what's, what's the deal with it? Is it any good? Oh god, please run. Please run. I mean, from the from what I saw from the Halo 5 stream yesterday, it looked pretty good. It looked enjoyable, but um, I've never been a massive fan of Infection in the first place. So, uh, you know, I guess if I thought it looked good, that's a good thing, right? Jared, please, Jared. Oh, 55, 55! Don't go around that corner. He went around that corner. Oh God, is that all the damage he t uh, takes? Oh, you're updating it right now, are you? Right. Okay. How big's the patch? I think the last one was 8 gig, right? Um, Ghost of Meridian, was it? Um, like, how, how, how big's this one? If it's 8 gig again, then I'm going to have to do it after the stream, because uh, I'm, I'm certainly going to forget whenever I want to play Halo. Uh, it's going to be like, oh, download this 8 gig uh, patch. And I'm like, oh, okay. I'll go make a sandwich then. Oh, dear. Protect the Tron, please. Do your job. Carry the Almighty! Oh god, you're all showing up now. Hey man, how you doing? You having a good day? Oh god. 4.2 gig. Fantastic. Fantastic. That is nothing. My internet will eat that up. So, very good. Alright, can we get over here? Can we do anything from over here? I feel like we have one turret and we have one Jared. I feel that's all we have. Yeah, there's the turret. I fancy 21. I fancy 21 here. Nope. Nope. Oh, good luck, Gary, on the silver pack. Oh god, yeah, I've got to, I've got to open silver packs again, don't I? Ah, oh, god damn it, I hate silver packs. All right, we're all out of stems. We're down to food, ladies and gentlemen. We are down to food. I want to get into a position where I could probably chuck a grenade in. That would be nice. Maybe from here. One turret and one Jared. Quite right. Both of them. Equally as annoying as the other. Alright, here we go. No, that is not the buttons upstart. That is not the buttons. Alright, here we go. I've forgotten the throw button, but hopefully it's this. Uh, Jared's glitching for the wall. Oh, Jared! Get absolutely mega destroyed. Have another. Grenades for all. Oh, did that hurt? I'm so sorry. Oh, I've run out. Oh, he's coming out now. He's coming out. Oh, yeah. How much health do you have still? How much health do you have? Jared, how much health do you have? You're still alive? Yeah, I am still alive. Um, 100k. God damn it. Well, I mean, again, I, I see you as like the Halo Pro. So I imagine that you've got like, I don't know. Did you get like every, have you got like every single wreck available already? Is that how you've been able to save up so much? Or um, like, oh God. Yeah, he's almost dead. Jared's almost dead. Sorry, chat. I'm going to have to concentrate on Jared for a little bit. I'm not ignoring you. Well, I kind of am, but still. Come on, Roy. Roy Silvers. Great shot. Whoa. Feel the power. We did it. We did it. A quest that has crossed two streams. We did it. There's one more. There's still one more. There's still one more thing up there. I don't know if it's a turret or not, but we can do it. Um... What? It didn't give me any of the new update stuff. That's so lame. Um, is it all actually out yet? Like, when do the new Rex enter the pool of regular Rex? I'm not too sure. Um, I think it did say, like, yesterday in the Halo stream, but... I mean, I've slept since then, so... Lord knows if I remember. <laughs> um, are we still in danger? We are. There's still something in here. Ah, oh, there you are. Alright, buddy. Oh, God. Okay, please. Um, right, let's see, let's see. I mean, to be honest, if you just, if you've opened a pack and you've got 1,500 rec points anyway, it's not like the worst thing in the world. You've topped up your silvers and, um, you know, you've, uh, you've topped up your silvers and you've uh, got most of your rec points back. But, yeah, I would wait a little bit until it's, like, guaranteed that all of those new recs are actually in the pool. Because I don't think they're in there straight away. I might be wrong, but, I don't know, it might take a little while. 
I don't know what time it is over there for you guys, but it's still, you know, it's just like kind of uh, mid up. It's kind of, kind of like afternoonish evening for me. Still lame. Yeah, I mean it is lame. I know. We kind of want it like at mid at midnight, don't we? Midnight launches and all that, but uh, you know, you want to give them time. You want to give them time. I think what they want to do is make sure that infection doesn't blow up straight away. I imagine that on day one of Griff Ball, when everyone just went onto it, probably just went crazy. Just like all the servers just died, you know. 9 a.m. for 343. Yeah, there you go. I mean, I'm not even awake at 9 a.m. <laughs> so, you know what? Yeah, just, just give it a while. Give it a while, and then hopefully you'll get something good. Hopefully, anyway. I mean, one of the things that I'm quite interested in trying in the new Halo 5 patch is the new um, target designator loadout weapons. Do you know about those? Um, apparently, there's a, a new loadout weapon where if you like hover, you, well, if you aim at someone with like the the SMG or the AR, it kind of puts a little target marker on them, like a little diamond. So even if they go behind cover, you're still able to track their movements, which I thought was a pretty cool idea. I don't know if it'll be useful in the grand scheme of things, but um, pretty useful. Here is a tip for good aim: stop missing. Oh, not you as well, mate. <laughs> not you as well. Like, I know you weren't here for yesterday's stream, but I got a new follower, and his first, the, one of the first things he said was, You're a terrible shot! You know, it was like the most heartbreaking thing ever. <laughs> Can I make this jump? No, there's a button here. I don't need to make this jump. Boop. Oh, God. I feel so happy that I've done this quest. <laughs> Seriously. Um, oh, uh, by the way, uh, for anyone that's watching this on uh, YouTube, or if any of my new followers are actually watching, um... Thank you to Abyss Fortune for yesterday. But there's two more that I missed. I missed a guy called Boosbury. Thank you. If you're watching right now, you didn't say hello, so and, and I kind of missed your, your notification. So apologies for that. Um, I do always appreciate new followers, but because I don't have notifications on, well, any kind of follower notifications, I do sometimes miss them. So apologies for that. But thank you to you, Boosbury. And an old Let's Play friend of mine as well also um, uh, followed me yesterday as well. Pookie Izzy. So thank you to you, good sir, if uh, you are around or if you watch this on YouTube, because I imagine you will. Uh, right. Uh, pipe revolver. I do like the pipe revolver. Nope. Nope. Too much. God damn it. Um, okay. <laughs> Let's put some crap in here. I have a lot of crap, which is why we need to start making things. Like, I, I have a baseball glove. I have a bread bin. <laughs> why am I carrying a bread bin? Oh, dear. Um, let's get rid of a weapon. We have too many weapons. In fact, no, let's get rid of armor, actually. Raid of levers. Uh, well, I need to get rid of eight, though. So, yeah, we'll get rid of one of these rifles, maybe. Um, store. Uh, store. And then we'll do one of the levers. Store. There you go. Um, oh, yeah, the brute plasma rifle. Yeah, I saw that used yesterday in the stream. The blue, uh, the the blue, the the brute plasma rifle seems very good. Apparently, it tears through shields really, really well, um, but it doesn't take out health like very well at all. So it's it's a nice compromise. It works well with melee. Apparently, if you uh, take down the shields really quickly with the with the plasma rifle and then use melee, it's actually quite a devastating little combo. So. Yeah, I was quite excited for that as well. I like um, uh, George's uh, minigun. I, I want to use miniguns so much more than I do. And I think if I had George's one, uh, you know, having that better um, like defense and movement speed, you know, I'd, I'd be quite excited to use that. Um, and of course, the Falcon that never was, aka um, Phaeton Helios. That's quite exciting to use as well. Right, where is... Wait, did it blow up? Oh no, someone, well, oh, they, in fact, no, that was actually a good thing. Someone actually blew up from my uh, expertly placed uh, uh, bomb there, my, my bottle cap mines. Oh, oh cool. Oh yeah, when bottle cap mines blow up, I imagine the bottle caps actually go everywhere, so that's pretty good, so you can recollect them. Yeah, the minigun. Minigun looks pretty good, man, looks pretty good. I mean, I'll never get it, because uh, Mythic Legendaries, man, are just so hard to get. I still don't have a single legendary helmet. That that's that's my look. I I I've not got a I've got a, not got a single legendary helmet. I've got one of everything else, but no legendary helmet. So, you know, I will never be George. 
I will never be Jun. I will never be Cat. I really want to be Cat. With or without the, uh, with, with the, the robot arm. <laughs> Alright. We're out of here. We're out of here, boys. We're out of here. We've done the quest, finally! The guy from Ten Pines Bluff will be so happy. Oh, God. Again, most of you guys weren't here yesterday, but I had such a bad day. It was... Wait, did I just go through the same door? Yeah, I think I did. God damn it. I had such a bad day. It was so, so bad yesterday. And Mr. Ray Koma was here, and he experienced it. I got my ass kicked by literally everything. Literally. Like, my lurks a go-go. Um, I was surprised that Death Claw didn't get me. Every single raider had their way with me. It was, it was disgusting, guys. It was absolutely disgusting. Uh, but we did it. I don't even know where we turned this quest in. Where did we turn this quest in? Um... Uh, oh, back at Sanctuary, right? Uh, oh, no, no, Ten Pines Bluff, of course. I've just said it. I've just literally said Ten Pines Bluff. Um, right, I got another one the other day. Void Dancer, that makes nine. Joke, it's free. I have all the wrecks, but now time to collect. Are, are the wrecks actually in the pool now? Like, are they actually a thing? Do we have official notification that the memory uh, memories of Reach Rex have reached the main pool? Hopefully they have. Hopefully they have. And I hopefully, hopefully tonight, ladies and gentlemen, in this stream, one of my good followers will get something absolutely epic. Or legendary. There you go. Settler, talk to me. Talk to me. Did you find those raiders? Yes, I did. Um, I kicked their asses. Well, I mean, I, I did eventually. Yeah, I kicked their asses for you. <laughs> no kidding. That's the best piece of news we've had around here for a good long time. So yeah. we've been talking. We decided if he came through for us, we'd join up with the Minutemen again. Yes. If we want things to get better. We've got to start helping each other. Quite so, right. We're in. You can count on us if you need help down the line. Thanks again, Fred. We did it, guys. We did it. We did it, guys. We're the best. So apparently we have now gained the help of these two people. Brilliant. I went for all of that for you two. Oh God, God, you make me so angry, Ten Pines Bluff. So angry. Um, there's apparently there's a workbench here, right? Is, is that what it just said that I can use the workbench here? Uh, no idea where it would be, but apparently it's around here somewhere. Um, is it over here? I mean, it's not much of a settlement. They've got like a little kind of uh, farmland thing going on here. I'm trampling all over their crops. But, uh, you know, it's fine. They don't mind. I'm a nice guy. What have we got here? Anything? Out and out. No. Okay. All right. So, that was the first thing I wanted to do today. Uh, the second thing that I want to do is I really want to learn how to kind of do base stuff. Like, in this game, there's a focus on building your own base, collecting materials to create things and whatnot. I mean, that sounds like heaven for me. It's like having my own Barbie's little dream house, but it's like an entire world map. I can like create a sniper tower, which would be fantastic. I can just sit up there with uh, with my beer and my Doritos, and I can just snipe all day. I mean, that would be fantastic if I could do that. I don't think I can, but I need to kind of learn how to do it. Now, uh, I did this workshop thing, and I clicked this, and apparently, if I walk around, I can scrap things. This is what my friend told me yesterday. And apparently I can even scrap, like, broken down houses? Like, can I even do that? Some houses I can actually scrap, apparently. Uh, let's see if we can find one to scrap. Yeah, so if I wanted, I can scrap this entire house. Let's do it! That is a lot of steel. Boop! There you go. House done. There you go. Uh, and apparently I can scrap cars as well. I mean, it takes away from the scenery. I do very well understand that. But I feel that you need to use your resources. Uh, this is th These are all resources that I want to use. I mean, we'll scrap the streetlight. Why not? Boop. We'll scrap this tree. Why not? Boop. And we'll scrap this car as well. Boop. Like, we got now have a lot of steel. All right, good. I, I feel better knowing that that's a thing. I can basically just smash this entire place. Oh, I can actually assign people uh, things. Uh, Sturgis, I want to assign you something. Oh, uh, I actually have to guide you to something, do I? Oh, okay, fair enough. 
Fair enough. Fair enough. All right. Um, exit. Right. Uh, no, don't do that. I want to do this. Okay. So. Um, did you get Fallout 4 for the? <laughs> did you get Fallout 4 for the full quid equivalent of sixty dollars? Um, no, I actually got it as part of a deal at Christmas. Uh, it was bundled with the with the Xbox One, so I couldn't really put a, an actual price on it. So uh, I'm not too sure. Let's say I technically got it for free, even though I kind of didn't. Um, but yeah, I got it for Christmas. A lot of people have been asking me, I thought you were, like, in financial crisis and had no money. I have no money, but I got this for Christmas. I treated myself at Christmas, and I hadn't played it till like, three days ago. So, yeah, I've been very patient. Scrap a person! Alright, let's scrap a person. Uh, Marcy! No one likes Marcy! What? No, you can't do that, guys. You can't scrap a person. <laughs> I mean, I'd love to scrap a person, but can't do it, unfortunately. Alright. So, in order to make a bed... Um, which we still can't build. Oh, well, we can! Oh! The reason why I've not been able to build it is because it's not been in the right place. Oh, God, that's why the build option was... was, uh, uh grayed out. Oh, we're idiots, guys. Well, I am. You're not. You guys are beautiful, and I love you all, but I'm an idiot. All right, where are we going to put this bed, guys? Where are we going to put this bed? Should we put it in the middle of the road? Just, like, five beds there? <laughs> yeah, scrappy human being. Gain skin four, kidney two. Beautiful. <laughs> I like that. I like that. All right, let's um, let's put beds like where you'd normally expect a bed, not in the bathroom. Um, does this look like a bedroom to you? Not really. Uh, this looks like a bedroom, but that's got a crib in it. Uh, so yeah, that's where the baby sleeps. That's where the baby sleeps, guys. Uh, we need to find what would be a proper b uh, bedroom. <laughs> Zero brains. That would be what would happen if someone scrapped me. Yeah, that that would uh, that would be me, unfortunately, because I have zero brains. Two kidneys, perfectly uh, well functioning, I think. Um, if anyone wants uh, one of my kidneys, then go ahead. <laughs> uh, right. Should we put one? No, that's the bathroom as well. I think putting it anywhere would be pretty pretty tricky. Uh, let's cancel that actually. Can we scrap this bed? I want to scrap this bed. We're going to scrap this bed. Uh, no, nope, that's the wrong button. Nope, that's the wrong button as well. Let's do that. Um, hold that to open up the menu. There we go. We're going to scrap this. We're going to get rid of this. Okay, boom. Done. 20 wood. Brilliant. I feel like I'm playing Minecraft now. <laughs> uh, Gary wants my kidneys. You know what? They're all yours, mate. You have given me a lot of loyalty. Um, and I much, very much appreciate that. So yes, you can have first dibs on my uh, on, on my bed. Scrap everything? What, including this plastic pumpkin? You monster! You fiend! <laughs> These nuts. God damn it. Um, right, we need to create a bed. Uh, oh, oh, I can move things as well. Oh, fantastic. Oh god, I love this. I mean, should we just play this like instead? Instead of like playing the actual game where we have to like save the world. Should we just like play this? I mean, that'd be good. Can we? Can I reorientate the, these beds? I can. Oh, fantastic! All right, what we're gonna do is this. It's a lovely rug, man. It's a lovely rug. Uh, <laughs> or smash all the pots, or um, yeah, basically that, John. Basically that. Um, all right. Boop. First bed done. Oh, I get experience for placing beds. Fantastic. So this is gonna be like one bedroom. There you go. There's one bedroom there. Okay. Um, should we just make this like the bedroom house? I feel like we should just make this a bedroom house. Uh, let's turn the light on. Can we turn the light on from this menu? Probably not, actually. Uh, oh, God. Let's scrap that. Oh, there's another bed here. All right. Scrap that. Scrap the bed. Um, I don't want to scrap the safe. Safe seem pretty cool. Although, you probably get a lot of metal from the safe. We're going to make this into a little bit of a bedroom as well. Uh, all right. 60% done. 80% done. Um, pack of cigarettes removed. Hmm, interesting. I guess maybe cigarettes account for cloth? Hmm, interesting. We're going to put one more in here as well, maybe? Like, is there anything I can scrap in here to kind of make room? Uh, there is something. Oh, there's a chair. Uh, we'll move this over here. There you go, there you go. This can be like solitary confinement. If anyone's been a very bad boy, or girl, like Marcy, we can stick her in here. Uh, so let's stick with it. Oh, 
Silly bed, what are you doing up there? Get down here. Seriously, bed. Behave. Alright, let's reorient orientate you uh, out here, and then let's see if we can pop you in here. Yeah, this is solitary confinement. So when Marcy is giving me all of her kind of pessimistic negative crap, which I don't need, by the way. I have lost my wife to Russian terrorists, and my baby has been kidnapped. So I don't need her crap. But when she gives me that crap, we send it to solitary. So, here we go. Here we go. Let's see if we can... In fact, no, I'm going to purposefully, like, put it askew slightly, just so it really annoys her. Um, so there you go. Boop. There we go. We did it. We did it. Oh. If you smash the pumpkin, you get rupees. Keepo. I mean, John. John, you know I'm going to do it, right? Yep. Two plastic rupees. <laughs> Boop. Oh, wait. Can I? I know, right? I did it. I did it, guys. I did it. I'm a monster. I did it. I sold it. Uh, it's all right. In the future, we'll make another. What else can you make? Power. Oh. Oh. A generator. Oh, my lord. Okay. Um. I know, right? Like, imagine trying to... Like, how do you get into that bed? Oh, how do you get in that bed? Oh, God, it's so difficult. Look at it. Look at it. I, I can't do it. I can't get the... Um, right, so, ladies and gentlemen, one 